Welcome back everybody to Farming Simulator 19. Almost said 17. Ooh, Farming Simulator 19, folks. Your host with not the most, Mr. Blue, aka Tommy Miller. Folks, this is going to be my first midnight, so I just wanted y'all to see what's going to be tucking out. Well, we're watching the moon also, so here in just a couple seconds, it's going to show it up on the bright top corner up there. Loan interest is 1938 oh, That ain't bad. That ain't bad at all. Um, yeah, uh, it's beautiful. Uh, it was darker in this round. Uh, let's see, about round 9-ish. And uh, it was too dark to see the tree stumps and stuff, so... Uh, I figure I'll give you a little fast forward of the moon there for a second and then uh, show you what was taken out at midnight so far. Uh, while I'm fast forwarding time to the uh, yeah, saving content, please save. While I was fast forwarding to daytime, I uh, just want to come in here. And I don't know what's under. Um, over this in here. Uh, we got a balance of 7058 The loan is $345,000 left to go to pay back. Uh, that was up there quite a bit of ways. I did sell some things, so uh, I don't have... This is all the stuff I have. I do not have the front loader or the bucket for the front loader because I got it for... I got to Sabmar and Sabmar don't support it, so I let that go back. And I've been doing some other things. It's been taking some money out. And you see vehicle leasing costs, uh, vehicle running costs, uh, land purchase. Oh, folks, let me tell you something. Construction costs. Yeah, it is this. We got a new tool. Okay, we still about around a little before 3 a.m. Look at those clouds, folks. Look at those clouds going across. That is just awesome. I don't know which way the sun should come up over this way. I'm in the wrong spot. I need to I need to get up this hill here real quick. Probably been faster driving. Going through these bushes. But anyway, um I just want to show you a little bit of nighttime and then we're going this video is probably gonna be really choppy. Uh, as far as uh it's gonna be a lot of video clips probably. Uh and if uh y'all didn't see an episode yesterday, I'm sorry. It's probably because I was trying to uh get this and put together because there's a lot i ain't got but one field of crops growing okay we'll get up here All right, it's gonna be kind of cloudy this morning that's supposed to be the moon not the sun it looks like the there come sun don't it Well, sorry, I was going to give you the sunrise, but I guess that was it. Huh? We'll have to watch that again and see what happens. I could have swore that was the moon going across there. But it's 5 a.m. I'm going to stop at about 7. But I'm going to slow it down just a little bit. So, about right there. So, we can go in here and look at this real quick. Uh, there we go. Um, I did a couple of missions, but as you can see, I got a lot more missions to do. Um, harvesting. There's going to be a lot of harvesting. Cultivating. I don't have a cultivator, so uh, sowing. Uh, we have to lease this. 
and sometimes that's not bad and this will probably be doing in this video some uh, I don't quite know for sure yet um, storage capacity workers currently hired we got storage capacity I don't know what that means but anyway uh, completed transport missions missions completed it's five trees cut down it's 18 so far uh, it's fertilized driving distance getting on upper not very much plow time work times not very much but this is for another day too though I need to get you on that one um Uh, so these last ones are that's the last one the rest of those are just setting so um but anyway let's go over here go to the growth we'll back out you can see there's a lot of fields that need to be harvested and that's where our money's at so uh that's what I'll probably be doing and let's get in here you can see um that plowed is this field it's going to go on around come back down here and then i'm going to reshape this in here and this is one that's growing we kind of nipped the corner of that there but yeah that looks like the moon you can see it's getting a little darker uh, i'm going to fast forward this to the max and that's going down. So that's the moon. Here's the sunrise. And that's going to be in the way. Oh, I don't want to fall down. There's our field down there growing. There's the sunrise. All right, good. Y'all get to see the sunrise with me. Boy, it's bright. All right, we're probably about, oh, come on, seven o'clock, time to go to work. All right, folks, I'm going to do a jump cut. There's a lot of stuff I got to get done. Uh, just kind of back up and show y'all so far. I've been uh, cutting some trees down through here, and you can see the mountains deform right there. Well, I do have a uh, thing on that, too. Uh, I should have been up here mowing this grass. But uh, if we go into wrong one, our shop menu, we'll buy and sell equipment, there's a shovel up here now. Well, the landscaping mod is out. Well, not mod. It's uh, software or hardware, whatever you want to call it. They added it into the game. Um, the, it's a a lot to it and it does cost a lot of money to keep an eye on our money up there um, just kind of go through here just a momentary to show you what we can do um, there's still a lot I don't know because I'm still trying to change strength for its Q left control and Q and E I want the strength of the brush to be about two, I think. Brush size, we're we going to make that real big. Oh, that's... All right, brush size. There's arrow keys. Ah, right, okay. We can go up to a 20. Yep, right there. All right, but what I want to do is see uh, as your shapes square to a circle. Um, change, and it'll be X. 
And then you get down here at the bottom right, you can see it's ground type. And be tab. And I want to go to that, and I believe that's the grass. And you can see right there. I get this thing out. See how it takes the, the trees away. I might need to. Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, there we go. I'm going to drop that down some. And as you can see, it, it just takes the the uh, weeds out. And you can see how I'm down to 6,300. The over right over here, six thousand one hundred. So uh, yeah, it, it takes a lot of money away. So uh, we're gonna get out of this and go over here and look. Next other thing I wish they would put in here is to speed up the walking. Now we got these big old rocks and stuff here to. To mess with and we'll take them out too but uh, i just wanted y'all to see uh part of that and it, it can go to a lot of other people's uh channels kentucky farmer he's got it where he uses it more and uh, probably peanut mr peanut channel uh peanuts channel is down below in the description but folks, I'm going to go ahead and do a jump cut. Sorry, 12 minutes. We got, <laughs> we, oh, oh, I forgot about that. Uh, I forgot. You can't hit X. Um, yeah, X to throw the hand modification mod or whatever you want to call it. You can grab it and you throw it, carry it, whatever. So you got to kind of look away a little bit when you get in. But, um. I think I'm going to bail some of this grass. Because there's a lot here before I get destroying a lot of it. So, uh, let me get some of these trees. Like, I got one there and one right behind that and to cut down and get rid of. And these tall, skinny ones, you can see right over there, they got little, like, gray sticks out in the field. I think I got four or five cut down. So, uh folks by the way i hope y'all doing all right and uh hang on we're gonna be right back okay a little bit more farming sim i don't know if we do any more farming today but we gotta get these trees cut ground uh tuck away and uh when i return here in a second we'll go over some of uh the wood chip prices and stuff so be right back folks all right, folks. Yeah, I'm back. I'm tired of lifting trees. It's currently almost 7:30. Throw. Fall. Yay! Don't climb wood chippers at home, folks. But folks, uh, I say folks a lot, don't I? Our trailer's almost full. Oh, so close, but so far away. Maybe to this tree right here, I'll fill it. But I don't know how I ended up with two chainsaws, but I I got two. And I don't like the way this does. Oh, oh, got it right. Well, I had it. There we go. But anyway, I just want to say, I will come in and tell y'all about the wood chips before we go do anything else. And, um, we are currently at load, load six. I already made six loads. Uh, so when that thing gets full, it'll be seven. But so far on the six loads, I made 43,000. Four hundred and forty-nine dollars, uh, and I'm all but one load. Let's see, the first load was two thousand liters, 
no, sorry, 12,000 liters. I'm like, 2,000 liters? And I said, what? But that little bitty trailer I had, it held 12,000. But other than that, rest of them has been 45,000 liters full. And six loads, 43,449. So, is that going to fill it? I don't want to put too much in there. The wood chipper, I hold some, but 45,000, I am full. So, let's turn the wood chipper off. Uh, finish picking that mess up when I get back. I really ain't done nothing. This is two trees that I told you I was going to get. Uh, you can see how long it took. Roughly about 26 minutes. So, uh, yeah, hello train. There we go. The SMR is what I was wanting. Um... I don't have no need in taking the stump grinder with me, so I'm just going to park it. I guess the best way is any is right here. Now, some of these, let's see, flip it to that. There we go. Some of these trees I've been using a stump grinder on, like the little bitty small pieces like that left, it, it, it's just not worth it. But uh, also, before we go, uh, I don't know if I told y'all or not, but the 50 by 50, uh, wrong button, at least it's saving them. Uh, get out of here and go into this. Uh, there's this. And these here. The, the 50 by 50 square. I think in the last episode I was showing y'all about um, I was placing them down to get all this flat. That's the way to do it before the landscaping tool came in. But you can see right there how much I got left to get all this squared up and even up and stuff. But each one of those little 50 by 50 squares is 50 no, excuse me, 23,000, depending on how much uh, depth you go, as in how deep. But uh, I just want to come in and tell y'all about the wood chips and, and that there. Um, that's kind of why I haven't finished that. Yeah, I'm trying to get some money. But I usually do some landscaping, and then I'll put back 5,000 into the pay the bank back on you know the, each each load sometimes I make two or three loads but what I'm gonna do today I'm all over the road get my blinkers not blinkers but beacons on but I'm gonna take these wood chips to the uh, sawmill and then I'm gonna come all the way back and get the uh, the logs off that field and then I want to haul them to the to the sawmill so uh, it'd be like I said it's gonna be small jump cuts here and there so uh, I'll see you at the sawmill all right almost to the sawmill actually we're at the sawmill I'm just I have to go down to the last drive. It's got three. And, uh, there's the second one. First one's way back there. And we're, we're going, it's right up here. I'm going to slow down for this turn. And you can, can go around it, or you can go through it. If you don't do like I do, get all over the place. There we go. And then we just cut through here. Tell you what, I'll be glad when I get to own this place. I'm going to trim this place up. Yes, I know you can dump, but I'm going to back up get straight. Or straight in the hole anyway. Woohoo! 
which don't look like I can do that. There we go, straight back. Uh, I don't know what makes these controllers do that. But anyway, I'm going to write this down real quick. We got 43,449 off of six loads. This is the seventh load. And um, hopefully it's 8,935. Hopefully. And what did we get there? Whoa. 5,000 is that 5,000? yeah it looks like 5,000 5,913 wow okay I guess wood chips are 5,913 I know it's probably ridiculous to some of y'all about uh, doing this but uh, I like to keep up with some of the stuff Let's see 4, 5, 6 Nine, eight, nine. So we're at 49,362 for seven loads. So uh, our wood chipper cost 64,000 and the stump grinder was 5,000. So you say we got the stump grinder paid for, but uh, a little ways off from having the wood chipper paid for. Which I don't care, you know. If we get it paid for out of the wood, that's fine. If we don't, that's fine. But we got a lot of trees to cut down to make our farm great. So, uh, folks, look at that boat out in the distance there. And it's actually moving, too. That's awesome. And you want to know something else that's awesome? Y'all are awesome. I just want to thank each and every one of y'all so much for all the love and support. Uh, to that special someone, thank you. I, I'll never, ever, ever, ever forget it. But folks, this is where I'm going to take the logs to. This area right here. And uh, I'm going to use this trailer, or, or try to use this trailer. I know this has got the crossbars in the middle there, but I think there's no collision on them. So, what I'm going to do is, uh, I'm going to leave the video running and just edit it out because I got thinking, you know, if I get a lot of little small video clips, I might get them out of order when I go to edit. So, it'll probably be easier on me to just let the, the video record. And just come back in when I need to. And uh, it's, but if y'all see something different on the video, it's because I forgot to uh, edit out, okay, or in. But I will be right back. I'm gonna go get this loaded and uh, meet y'all back at the sawmill again. Uh, back in a second. All right, we are here at the sawmill once again. If y'all only knew how many trips I made off screen. It's not very many trees, but it's lots of trips. But this time I got logs instead of wood chips. And um, we're going to see how much we get for these. I can't remember, I think it's four big ones and one small one. I see they ain't done. Let me get out here and see the trigger, what the trigger this thing does. 11,274. Wood sold. 11,200. Wow. <gasps> oh, no, 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 no. I keep forgetting about that. Ah, there we go. 
and it took everyone up. We're currently at 23,000. 23,000. Now, if I had a front loader, it'd really make this more easier all the way around. Especially, good old American flag. Okay, um, I'm going to shut my beacons off. I'm going to shut the tractor off. Because we're going to go into our tools or, or, or catalog here iPad, whatever you want to call it. We're going to go over and look at cultivators. Cultivator prepares fields for the next so on. Additionally, this machine offers the possibility to see directly no previous cultivator in our plan on this. Well, look at that. Uh, 3.7, 4.9 meter. Yes, but it's only grass, reddish, and canola. Um, wow, 68,000, but it's 8 meters and 9 mile an hour. The price just keeps on. Oh, that's big bud material there. Let's see what this, uh, this one is. Six meters, thirty-one thousand. That's a cedar, also. I don't want no cedars. That's thirty-one thousand. Looks pretty tempting right here. All right, hang hang on, folks. Uh, what I'm doing? Oh yeah, go ahead and save. I saw a mission for a cultivating. Ooh, fertilizing. 18,000 to fertilize? Must be a big field. Folks, I have to jump on that. Uh, field 5, okay? Field 5. Uh, where's field 5? There's 6. That's field five. We need to visit field five. Reason four. So growth it is growing. We're going to visit. If I can get out of here. How do I get out of here? I might go through. Yeah, I got to go through the gate. Oh, more trees, more trees. I need a scorpion king for those trees. There's nothing in here. Of course, it's going to take me uh, quite a bit. I, I, I'm, I'm hooking up to this. Um, yeah. Uh, we got to go drop this off, folks. And then... Uh, hook up to our fertilizer trailer um, I'm gonna, I think I got about 4,000 left in there I'm not for sure so what I'm gonna do is probably hook up to the fertilizer buggy and then go to market shop probably buy two or three thousand and then um, accept that mission and go spray that or, to me, it seems like I make more money off of fertilized missions. What would be great oh, right now if we had GPS installed? Uh, anybody knows when that's coming out? <laughs> Shoot me a comment down below, please. I'm about to turn my flashers blinking on. But anyway, I will be back in a few seconds, folks. All right, I got 5,000 liters of fertilizer in here. I'm on the way to field five. I decided to go ahead and just borrow the equipment from them. Oh, folks, look at that cotton field there. 
that's that's the mission too. Um, it gives you two cotton pickers and a, a module hauler, uh, which was cotton hauler, but. You have to take the cotton all the way down to the wool area. So, yeah, I don't think anybody's going to be coming by that time I get there. So I'm going to go ahead and undo this. This is wider than mine. By a lot. So, uh, yeah, this is where I wish I had uh, the GPS mod because... It would really come in handy getting straight right now. Ooh, no, we are. I do have cars. Alright, here we go. I probably need to go over some more, but. Oh, yeah. This sucker is wide. Holy cow, look at that. I don't know. Um, I know when you use your own equipment, you keep what fertilizers left. But I don't know what happens if you got some left and you borrow their equipment. Do they uh, pay you back for the fertilizer that's in it? And that's where I'm curious. But it seems to be moving pretty good. And this is going to take a little bit. So, uh, you know what I usually say. Time for a jump cut. But first, uh, I got $13,709. Let's see if I lose any. Because I did buy it after 8 o'clock. So I should be alright till it reaches 9. So hopefully it won't take that long to do this. So. Anyway, folks, I'll be back in a second. All right, I'm just about done, folks. Just about done. And please don't pay no attention to my or my straightness, cause uh, yeah, nowhere near straight. Um, so far, I just lose just a little over two thousand liters. You can tell right here it's where it's <laughs> like a snake went through the field. But it's alright because right over there is my other uh, pass. And I'm at 97. I don't know when you lease the equipment they tell you when you're done because I know if you use your own equipment they don't tell you when you when the thing is completed. So I'm 98. But, uh, yeah, I kind of look. You can see here. Real bad crooked. Real bad crooked. Of course, this field isn't straight either. Swapped out controllers. I'm using my daughter's controller. Um, thought that it was better than mine. Come find out her. X button is sticking. Uh, my camera wants to do like that all the time. And on this controller, it wants to go up. So I'm like, oh, goodness gracious. But it's a whole lot better than mine. Well, mine does that a lot. This don't do it very much. But anyway. See, we're completed. And, uh, We'll shut this off. We still got from there to there. And we probably would use 2,500 liters. So 2,500 liters of fertilizer to do fill five. But uh, I'm going to stop right here because this is saying we're completed. Uh, contract reward. It's 18867 lease cost minus that. Reimbursement was $4,114. So it comes to $20,000. So, all right. That's what I'm talking about. 
uh, collectors X. Yeah, I don't know about no mowing or sewing for that much. Uh, got baling, uh, sewing, harvesting. Oh my God, field 22. I just wonder if, I don't think you get, how can I say, social points maybe? And not Farmer Dynasty social points, but you know, the, the green process bar making them happy. Uh, I don't see that on any of these. Because see, this guy here, I just done a couple missions on with him. But we got Harvesting Bill 13. Harvesting's okay, but uh, I don't know, folks. Fertilize seems like it's the way to go. Now I'm out here in the middle of nowhere and I got to teleport. But anyway, at least I got my tractor back to here. It's time to do some uh, stuff of our own. Not no trees. I'm gonna give y'all a break from trees. But um, I like to do some baling. I also need to do some plow. Uh, before I do anything, I guess we're gonna mow some grass and bail it up. Um, I do have 33,000. Uh, I can put that back in a bank or I can take some out of the bank. I need a teller handler or, or some kind of fort lift arms or, or, you know, something I can grab some trees with and load them up in that trailer. But those big tall straight ones right there, I think it would come in handy. So, I thought about buying, let's go ahead and take the money out of the bank and buy a 6M or a 6R. Let's go to medium tractors. Um, wait, did I just pass? So, here's a 6M for 119000 probably about 100 50,000 times we're done with everything. But I think we need a little small tractor to help us out because we gotta have some way of loading the bells, moving the bells. Um, I guess it'd work if I. Oh, this is a weight. Oop. We want the max weight. Always max weight. I just don't know about the front. Oh. Ha <laughs> ha Yeah, no. Is that the only kind? Okay. Changes. Wide tires. Narrow tires. That's what we're going to be needing. Uh, I do want to get a fertilized buggy for this thing. And, uh, we can get the wide tires for it. Twin. We, we, we're going to get our uh, skinny tires on it. And wait. 6155 looks like the biggest one. Yeah, 6155 is the biggest motor. And what is our horsepower now? 164 horsepower. 24 mile an hour. I like where it looks. Alright, with all that right there, the 6M is 134,000. Okay. Let's try the 6R. Uh, as far as it goes, the 6R. Okay, the engine setup, we're going to get the biggest, which is 6250, looks like. Yep, front loader attachment. See, I didn't even check that on a 6M. I didn't see if it had it. Um, wide tires, twin wheels, rear twin wheels, wheel weights, wide tires with weights, standard. Oh, see, we can't do... 
can't do narrow tires. But we can do a front loader. So let's back up to the 6M. I didn't even check for the front loader. That's what I'm leading, needing it for. Um, the heaviest weight there is. Uh, I guess I got to go with those. Narrow tires. 6155. Let's see, I do that. And it takes the option away. What was the option that took away? Huh. Was it the weight? See, it gives us a thing right here to scroll down. Front loader attacher. Yes, I guess we can't have it with the weights on there. So it takes it away. Can we not have weights at all? We sure can't. Okay, well, we can just buy a weight for the back anyway, so. Um, 164 horsepower, front loader attacher, biggest engine, narrow tires, and uh, we're going to do that. So we need 134,000, folks. Oh, I wish we could go ahead and buy. I need 134,000, so about 150,000 is what we're going to be needing. Um... Not this episode, but the next we're gonna we're gonna buy that folks. Uh what I'm gonna do is let's see, I'm gonna unfold that. Probably can't go this way. Let's go right up here. Let's see. Lower pickup, turn that on. And go to the front, lower that down, turn it on. Oh, let's go bailing. But well, we got to have uh, okay, we are getting some out of that, not much. Okay, I just want to check, make sure that was going to work like that. Uh, anyway, what I was saying was we got to go on the other side over there, get the grass mowed and uh, picked up, bailed up. We're not running season, so we can stack the bales outside anywhere. Um... Turn that off. Turn that off. Pick the baler up. Um, yeah, we're going to go over here, do this up here, folks. Uh, get bailed up. Put the bales to the side somewhere. And uh, finish getting this plowed. We need to get it planted in oats. Um, I'm going to try to get horses first because my daughter's really wanting to see them so I'm just you know and that's one reason why I need to get them let's see turn baler on lower it down mower on cruise and here we are going to town not much to see in this here. No, I don't see. The Blob Emergency Squad doing something, so I'll just shut that off so we can uh, finish this vlog, or vlog, 
finish this uh, here out. We are getting some, but what much as I done ran over this grass and stuff, and plus it ain't been fertilized. You know, it's just uh, it's going to take a bit to get some bales. But uh, sheep don't need. I, oh, I can't do this for horses anyway. They have to have hay and not grass. This has to be tedded. See, I'm on a mower. I'm going to go ahead and shoot the mower off. I got to level a lot of this up too, folks. I'm going to cut these trees out of the way, get this all leveled. But uh, I just want to make some bales. Uh, if anything, we sell them. But, uh, oh, we, we, we might do small sheep, I don't know. Oh, this tractor ain't going to pull it uphill very much. I'm going to start cutting. Turn the mower off. I'm on. Back it up it. Oh, we got our first bell fixing to be pooped out here in a minute. But, uh, is that tree? Oh, no, oh, oh, that tree is solid. Well, that's a little bitty baby one. Shut all this off. Wow, I've never seen a tree so small. Question is, can I even cut it? Oh, I had it. Alright, how low can I go? Oh. I find out when I go plow. Oh, wow, really? That's one way. I, oh, no, 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 don't do that. And also, folks, I did have to uh, put a half a tank of fuel in this thing already. Let's see, both of them's down, so let's get mowing again. What I'll probably do is just take and throw these bales in that wagon. I just wonder if I can pick them up. I don't even know how heavy they're going to be. And the other thing is, will the grass grow back where I painted it? That's one thing I was wondering about. Probably not. Well, okay. Um, oh, I didn't want the baler. I wanted the mower. Whoa, hold on here. Come on. I know I don't have access to that land yet. All right, folks. I'm going to uh, do a jump cut, and I'll come back when I get some more done. All right, be right back. Alright folks, I think that's going to be all that mowing, mowing and bailing I do for right now. Whoa, slow down, Tommy. Alright, as you can see I got 
two, four, five, six, seven. Up there be eight, and then nine if I continue the one that's inside. So three, six, seven right there. Drop off. Yeah, three, six, seven. And then I got one up here. I'm not gonna drive all the way up there. I'll just carry it. So I got eight plus what's in Moo Bird. Oh, uh, where'd that bell go? Ah, right there. I have still yet not been able to find a helicopter. I see a bird. I bet over down there at the bottom left, you see that kind of a gray looking square on the little mini map. Um, let me pull it up here. This thing right here, I bet you that's an airport. That's why I'm hearing helicopters. Um, can't click on it to go there or nothing, so. And who knows? What's this? Oh, it's my plow. Okay. As you can see, we got plow. We got the Sebmar. Oh, that's Sebmar. That's me. Uh, of course, the baler. I said the baler. Uh, well, whatever. Uh, yeah. But most of the equipment's parked up here. Let's go to land so y'all can see what I own. This is all I own right now. I'm wanting to get this. But it's 200000 you might well say. And then to get this, it's an extra 152000 Um, That's a pretty good square piece of land right there, but Whatever that building is right there, that's the only thing that's on it. The rest of it's just trees. Um, that's a good spot. It's nothing but trees. All this down through here is nothing but trees till you get to these here. Um, uh, Biogas heating plant. Barn. Let me take those hay bales to here. Um, or not hay bales, grass bales. I um, thought about just throwing them in there. And uh, how I get back out of here? Let's hit B, I guess. But anyway, I thought about just throwing them all in the trailer and hauling them down there. And um, just sell them because they're really not good for nothing right now. I know, I got to start my... But I just wanted to get the grass off there and it kind of give us an idea of what a grass bale would sell for. Um, I really don't know how long it would take to load them. But the problem is right now, you, when you grab things, you can't reach up very far. So, But anyway, I'll probably do that on the next episode. Um, I'm going to get some of these fields plowed off screen. And uh, probably go get some lime or something and maybe do some uh, harvest missions. Right up here is where I've been putting my equipment. Make sure it's good out of the way. Alright, I'm going to drop the more at first. Now back into the tree. That would be terrible. I'm going to park the baler beside this tree. But I do think I need to get a front loader or, or something. I mean, don't block the planter. Go ahead and fold this thing up. I don't want to block none of the equipment. Uh, unload that there. Or not unload, but you know what I mean. But anyway, folks, I don't know how much time I have uh, rendered out on this, but I do know I need to get busy planting. Uh, look at our canola field. It's already took shape, and uh, we got, we got to look at that. I see. I'm going to uh, use this little guy to square up the edges. 
I uh, wish I had money to put some buildings and stuff in. Let's check see if we got any weeds in this yet. Um, fertilize. Weed, 100%. Does that mean it's got weeds in it? Or 100% free of weeds? Oh, lordy. It's probably got weeds in it. I don't see none offhand. But I'm thinking about really before I even think about planting or, or anything. I, I need to do my ground. But I ain't got that much money. So I don't know. I think I'm going to square the fields out with the plows. And the best I can go ahead and get some planting. Like I probably would uh, see the round circle in the middle of the screen. The cursor. I'm probably going to stop about right there. I'll leave some room where I can bring the trees down. But I'm going to get that squared up best I can. Get this and squared up best I can. Lime fertilize all the good stuff. And plant some oats. That way we'll get some horses. I don't know when we'll get the horses, but yeah. I'm going to get a silo. Put the oats in. I also need to plant some beans too, but hey, we can only do what we can do, right? But uh, till next time, folks, uh, I hope y'all enjoyed it. Um, please hit that like button. Share me with your friends. Um, turn the bell on. And don't forget to check out the other links down below of all the nice YouTubers that help me out some way or another. And also, if you're feeling generous, I do have a PayPal link if you want to help support my channel. That would be awesome. And folks, I guess I'm just going to get busy. I don't know where I'm going to put my sheds and stuff. I think I got enough ground for or buildings and stuff. But uh, I'm just going to square this off here. And, you know, like I just talked about, and uh, get busy. Uh, doing trying to get my farm going here. I know I let that down, but I forgot to uh, create fields there. That's, that's about as best squares as I can get it, probably. So, until next time, I hope all your dreams and stuff comes true. But, uh, Mr. Blue, aka Tommy Miller, is fixing to get out of here. Uh, so, y'all have a great day. A blessed day, and I will see y'all later, folks. Bye.